public life as a worship leader starts with your private life with the Lord. They like our intimate lives with Jesus and how much that really, really just affects what kind of a worship we do on a Sunday. Being more intention of be like selecting the songs that are actually being played as opposed to just playing through something, a set list. Yeah. As far as my leadership goes, definitely uh, learning to keep things simple. Uh, and then just taking into consideration what's going on within uh, our local church that not every s Sunday morning it's a, it's a celebration that we need to be there with them through the valleys and through the dark times as well. How to tell your electric guitarist how to play well, how to play well as a keyboardist, um, how to take care of your voice. Um, so it was a lot. It was both the practical side and the spiritual side. It was a lot about growing emotionally and spiritually and just all about how to be a better worshiper in Hall, not just a worship leader, but a worshiper. Uh, it was amazing to get to go into the studio and like record it all live like I've never done that before and I was just super excited to be around other Christians and worship leaders. Be able to lay down a track with a group of amazing musicians is an experience that cannot be compared to anything. The moving pieces of music and understanding how, how to make space for each other on the stage and to like really worship together rather than uh, kind of make it the you know, Bobby show or the Steven show and, and that was amazing. Little pieces of like golden wisdom that I could use every single day. I think the most practical thing I learned was just kind of uh, <laughs> the whole, they showed lots of Google studies and just leadership and what's worked. Psychological safety is an amazing, amazing, amazing tool. They're just little things that put my thoughts together really, really well in a lot of little practical ways. And of just really intense learning. Some of the days are like 14 hours and you're just, you're getting so much taking notes. Feeling like I have permission to, uh, to lead and to step up and just try things out. Uh, confidence in moving forward through him and with intention. Learn how to be a better worshiper, how to grow in your spiritual life and emotionally, to be encouraged and uplifted by people who have these same desires and want to work together in their giftings that God has given you. Like, this is definitely the place to be. I filled up. I think that that was the amazing thing is to just to have a week away from the responsibilities of the world and opportunity just to rest and rest in worship. A, a tool belt full of resources and coming to the Vineyard School of Worship uh, adds imperative tools to your tool belt. I say come out, do it, you will learn something no matter what.